Well, it's been a brutal summer here in Australia with the bushfires and the floods. So I haven't seen the sky pretty much good, yeah. at all for a yeah. while. All the clouds um, are going. <laughs> but tonight the sky is clear, the sun yeah. is shining, yeah. the moon shining. is not out. So, so I'm going to do some Australia. Out, that's good. So My name is Dylan O'Donnell and, and you're watching Star Stuff. Yes, and we are going to die. has had his bath. It's time to put on the mozzie spray and get out to the observatory because I come from the land down under where everything wants to <coughs> And uh, kiddo number one should be going to bed. Isn't that right? <laughs> now let's see how much stuff is living in the observatory. Oh, it smells. It's so damp. Yep, all the uh, Moisture absorber has absorbed and it's humid as, which is not good because this stuff will get rusty. Uh, thankfully, the setup that I want to use tonight is already here, which is the ZWO1600MM and the RAS8. Uh, I think I'm just going to try and have some fun, so I'll just see what's up and maybe do a bit of mosaicing. Spiderwebs. Uh. Ah! Just kidding. Look at the mold on this. Um, this is one I left out. And this is what it should look like. And that's what happened to it. Um, just because of the humidity and all the spores in the air. Not oh, good. And that's why I keep everything in Ziploc bags. Man, these guys always come in during the rain, and I'm pretty sure they are living in all my camping gear. Take that, motherfucker! And that's also why I don't leave my imaging computer in the observatory. Oh, it looks pretty out there. dark enough to focus now and start using things but of course I haven't been in the observatory for a long time so the mouse is out of batteries everything is not going to work um, so I'm getting there I'm just fiddling with stuff but as I set up the camera just then I just realized that you can see Venus right there the evening star this year the morning star next year looking good on sunset okay I'm pointing at M42 I'm more or less in focus so I'm gonna try something interesting tonight I'm gonna try a mosaic. This is 16 degrees and you can see Barnard's loop clearly. It took a long time to download that to even begin to mosaic. Uh, but let's see what we can do if I drag some tiles over. Whew, it's gonna take a lot of frames. Um, I could just do this central region here, I suppose. That's not gonna get all of Barnard's loop, but there is still a lot of hydrogen in there, so that could be interesting. Pretty ambitious though. completely. Fix Insight and Adobe Photoshop are pretty good at merging a couple of frames together. Um, it's a bit of a run around process in Pix Insight doing the union with the star mask, star registration and all that. Uh, it's a bit easier with Photoshop which will just automatically detect the features that go over multiple frames and stitch them together. Uh, and it sort of did that with this one but the reason it failed was because my rotation was wrong. The rotation that Sequence Generator Pro was doing in the frame and mosaic wizard wasn't matching up with the rotation in actual reality. Uh, so everything's skewed and diagonal and it's not gonna layer well. So that was a learning experience. Uh, my consolation prize is that I then put the telescope over to Rosette uh, because I had the Rasa rate set up and that's a nice big target and I took some frames there. And that was a huge fail. <laughs> I can see the donuts of death on my image. 
uh, but that's okay because this was a night after a long hiatus because of the weather and I knew that things were going to go wrong. Uh, it was still so great to be back in the observatory. Uh, things that went wrong were the focus, the rotation on my uh, wide field mosaic, which I still want to nut out and the only way to nut this out is to keep trying. Uh, which I'll do. The other thing that I got wrong was I didn't have any beer at all after I started taking the images so it's possible that my lack of alcohol is responsible for all the mistakes and screw-ups I made. Anyway, this will happen to you and it happens to all of us uh, but that's okay. I'm still looking up, I'm still checking to see if Beetlejuice is there and remember everything is meaningless and we're all going to die. <laughs>